Hi everyone, my name is Sheridan. I work at the Long Beach Public Library, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to log reading, complete activities, and write book reviews in Beanstack to be able to earn points and prizes. First and foremost, you'll want to open up a web browser and navigate to longbeach.beanstack.org. This will take you to the Long Beach Public Library's Beanstack page, where using your account, you can log in. If you have a mobile phone or a tablet, you can also download the Beanstack mobile app add the Long Beach Public Library, and then that way you can use that app to be able to log reading, complete activities, and write reviews. It's available on the App Store and on the Google Play Store. Once you're there, you'll want to click Sign In and enter your credentials, your username and your password. This will take you to your Beanstack dashboard, where you'll see the programs that you're signed up for. To toggle in between readers, use the menu on the left-hand side. Currently, under my account, I've got three readers. I've got myself in the adult program, my daughter Panchita in the children's program, and my teenage son Panchito in the teen program. So I'll show you how to log for kids first, and then we'll switch over to teens and adults. Panchita's in the children's program, and the primary way of logging, reading, and activities is with the button in the top left corner. If you click there, Beanstack is going to ask you three questions. The first one is, which reader would you like to log for? And you can toggle here in between readers or log for all readers at the same time. And whether you want to log, let's see, Banchita, whether you want to log days or activities. So for today, Banchita read a book this morning, so I'm going to log for her today. She read on the 13th, you click on the day, and you can see that Beanstack doesn't allow you to log reading in the future. You can only log for today. And then hit log. So it looks like Beanstack told us that we logged and it added a green dot to the day to show that we logged reading that day. You can then hit the X button to go back. We'll also say that Panchita completed an activity this morning. So we'll go back to that same button, make sure that we're on Panchita's profile, and then click on the Activities button. It looks like she, let's say, this morning, helped us out with some gardening. So I'll click on that badge. And to log the activity, I'll check this little box. And you can see that Panchita unlocked a badge and earned a point. Click on the X to go back, and on the X one more time to go back. And now you'll see that Panchita has logged a day of reading and an activity and earned a point. To write a book review, we will click on this Add a Review button. Beanstack is going to ask us to write a review. And we'll type in the book title. She read The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carl. And what did she think? She thought that... The caterpillar ate way too much, but he turned into a very beautiful butterfly. We'll hit save, and we can even add an emoticon. And you'll see that Panchita has earned a point for writing a book review, and now that book review will be shared with the rest of the Long Beach community, so everyone can see what everybody else is reading. We'll hit X to go back. And now you'll see that under the logging badges, or the activity badges, this one has lit up because she's completed that activity. And those are the basics of logging reading activities and writing book reviews. For teens and adults, it's a little bit different because we ask them to read entire books. So for example here, for Panchito, let's say that I'm going to say that he is in the teen program and he wants to log that he read a book today. So we'll click on the Log Reading and Activities button. Panchito, books, today he read one book, and the title is Things Fall Apart by Chinua Achebe. Would he like to include a review? We'll say yes, and we'll hit log. You can see that he's earned a point. He had a, read a book previously, so now he's unlocked badge number two, and now we can write the review. Great book dealing with colonialism and 
the erasure of traditional cultures in Africa. And we'll hit save. Writing a review has actually unlocked another badge for him. Because at this point, Panchito has earned five points. You can see that he's earned a ticket, and now he can enter a drawing. If you click on the Enter a Drawing button, that ticket you can then apportion to either of the two grand prize drawings that are going to happen on July 25th. Panchito's really into snacks, so he's going to take that one ticket and add it to the Tokyo Treat subscription box in hopes that he wins a subscription to Tokyo Treat, which sends Japanese snacks straight to your door. And there he goes. Those are the basics of logging reading, activities, writing book reviews, and even adding raffle tickets to the grand prize raffles for the end of the summer. Thank you for joining us today. Hopefully you earn lots of prizes and have a lot of fun this summer.